The tutorial you're about to watch is from the Lightroom Organization and Workflow Workshop, which is part of the SR Lounge Lightroom Workshop Collection. This workshop on DVD starts from the ground up with Lightroom file management, organization, and health photographers to master a full professional post-production workflow. The workshop includes over 70 high-definition videos, and it totals nearly eight hours of uninterrupted education. Also included are 70 raw image exercise files and our workflow guide and checklist. Designed for Lightroom 4 and Lightroom 5 users, you can learn more or purchase this workshop from the SR Lounge store by clicking the link below in the description. Let's go ahead and get started. Last recommendation that I have for y'all in regards to customizing your working space is in regards to the actual computer desktop itself. So let's hit Shift F. Let's take us out of this full screen mode. We're gonna hit uh, this little minimize button to bring us to the desktop. And you'll notice that on my desktop, I have a gray background with our neutral SR Lounge logo in the back. This is a neutral background. And once again, the reason that we're using this background is to basically remove any possibility of the background or anything on our computer kind of affecting the bias that we have in our eyes when we're processing images. Let me give you an example of this. I'm gonna to go to my little desktop over here. I have these different wallpapers that I've kind of collected over time. These are just images of ours that I like and I've used. And let's set one of these to the background. So this is from the HDR workshop on DVD and uh, one of my favorite shots of Antelope Canyon. It's a beautiful image, but the thing is that there's so much color in this and it's so vibrant and so red that looking at this for any period of time and then flipping into Lightroom is gonna create a bias in the way that we see our images inside of Lightroom. We're gonna to appear to basically be seeing images much more red than they actually are. And we could end up overcompensating the other way and we end up having green images. So when we're working in Lightroom and we're processing images, we wanna eliminate all these things that can basically influence our visual perception of the images that we're processing. And one of those things is our desktop background. So once again, in the exercise files, we've included a neutral desktop background, which is automatically sized. It has the SR Lounge logo. You can again, go into Photoshop, create your own, drop your logo over the background. I would make everything a neutral gray and then just set that as a desktop background. So in, in Windows, we're just right clicking, setting as the desktop background. You can do the same thing in uh, on Mac. It's very simple. And now we have a neutral background. We can make sure we're basically eliminating all these things that can cause us to have a visual bias as we're processing images. All right, I think I'm done talking about customizing Lightroom and our working space and our view mode. So great job, everybody. Let's head on to the next video now.